What's up, everyone, and welcome to the 43rd episode of the New Vision Gaming Podcast. I'm your host, Brad's Gaming. As always, I'm joined by Clownish Joe. Howdy, folks. And Triple Bravo. Hello, everyone. And uh, two things we're going to be doing today, which is uh, the PlayStation State of Play was released today. We're going to be reacting to that. And also, uh, the only little announcement I have is that this is actually our one-year anniversary uh, this, uh, when we're rec- recording this. So, um, I loved you guys for so long. Yeah, it's I, pretty I, crazy that it's already been a year. One year ago, and some change, Brad got down on his knees and proposed to me this <laughs> this podcast idea. And I'd already said yes in my head whenever he said podcasts, but I just let him talk. And then Joe was like, yeah, here's some reasons why. And I was like, yeah, yeah, I guess I'll do it. But in my head, I was like, I'm totally going to do this. This is crazy. If you're going to drag me kicking and screaming, I guess, when do we start? Tomorrow? Tomorrow. (laughs) I think the funny thing is it literally was something like within three or four days, I think we recorded probably two episodes because the first one was rough the second one was rough and then the first released one was on june 3rd i yep. did we just do two i thought we did three we did two bads and one good yeah okay. I, I it could have been three but i i can't remember but i definitely remember two those with which rough. we shall not name or talk about any more than what we've already did look you just yes. gotta break off the <laughs> rust even if it's a brand new vehicle it's, you don't know what you're doing it's fine. true true yeah but, all right. Uh, yeah, we'll keep it. We'll keep it short though, because I think we're all pretty excited about the state of play. So yes. uh, let's very excited. Let's see what's going on with this. A lot of black screen. Okay. <clears throat> the PS Wait a ways away. Oh. Wait. Is this the remake? <laughs> okay. It looks so good. It does. to vacation, eh? You will receive our most sacred body. It begins now. Wow. Wow. It looks so good. That that does look really good. Um, I don't know that I could wait nine months. I could just forget what happened. Yeah. Tonight. That was more. The pain. Even for a second. This time. It can be different. Oh. It has to. Oh, I thought they were going to do some gameplay or something. That's. It was a cinematic view of gameplay right there. There was a few yeah. scenes that they had cut in that was actual gameplay. Yeah. So I paused it here in case you guys wanted to geek out or something. I'm gonna I'm gonna be honest. I do. I, I watched I, this and I was like, oh. I feel like and I was uh, like, I gotta shut it off. <laughs> I feel like it's almost hard to say anything because it's just like holy crap. Like we kind of got ruined because the, we knew uh, it was happening. Yeah, like, we knew it was now happening. it's happening. Yeah, exactly. So <laughs> I I'm actually surprised. 
I thought this was going to be like a 2025 game, to be honest. When they announced like, hey, we're doing a Resident Evil 4 remake, I was more thinking like, um, you know, probably like Resident Evil Village DLC. Then yeah. maybe they would do, um, I think a lot of people were saying that they were going to do the other Code Veronica remake. There's like rumors about that do. one. I hope yeah. they still do. So, and I, I was thinking they were going to take it like, sweet time on this game because it's so beloved um but wow it it does the re amazing. engine slaps it does but as soon yeah. as i seen like the r and heard the spanish music i instantly knew what it was yeah <laughs> is spanish music uh like a big thing in resident that game takes place in spain that okay. yeah yeah um, oh i gotcha i i will say i felt like they did like I wanted them to focus on like one scene for a little while longer. Just, We've seen the like, town a lot in that little trailer. I wanted, yeah, I wanted, time. I wanted to see like a little like actual gameplay. Which, obviously, I'm asking for a lot right here, but I'm sure yeah. we'll get some more in like the next few months and whatnot. So it's exciting. I'm, I mean, that's a day one easy. Yeah, easy. I, could I pre-order <laughs> it now? Because yeah, no, seriously, <laughs> like, when do I get to buy the big pack? That that's gonna like be the three hundred bucks. That's a double dip. That's what we call a double dip. That's a yeah. double dip. <laughs> that's, I want that's my actually... collector's edition, like now. <clears throat> All right, yeah. boring. Moving on. Yeah. <laughs> oh, VR All right. two content. I'm also... not surprised. Oh, yeah. I'm not too surprised because Resident Evil 7 has the VR. And, we've got and Resident Evil 4 has the VR mode today. now, so like, yeah. Thanks to Capcom for they're essentially just going to slap the new skin Evil onto 4. it. Coming to PS5 with PlayStation Do VR 2 content it's also in development. Nasty too. Now let's get a sneak peek at four games in development for PlayStation VR 2. Oh, okay. Oh, boy. It might announce the DLC for this, though. <sighs> now, let's take a look at him. Wow. Well, Ethan Winters. Oh my god, mommy can step on me in VR. <laughs> Let's see how special I'm getting a PlayStation. Yes, mother. <laughs> That's it. That's it. Bravo, what are you doing? I got the game pause. Leave me alone. <laughs> we kind of knew this was coming with the VR2. Yeah, I'm, I'm not surprised at all. Yeah, it unfortunately is going to make me probably pick up another copy of Village, which I'm not too thrilled about. It's, I don't think you'll probably have to pick it up. I mean, 7, I think, had automatically... Yeah, but it. like, I'm saying I don't own Village on the PlayStation. Oh! Dual wheel. Oh! That was pretty cool. <laughs> I definitely don't remember that scene. Oh, well, that was whenever they hooked you. Okay. Yep. Yeah. That does look good. Yeah. That. I mean, it's gonna be cool. Yeah. I feel like that I... game's gonna do fine in VR. That's literally the whole reason they went to first person. Mm -hmm. Some camera angles adjusted you, for trailer use. Of all people, have the audacity to question me? You, who emerged from the putrid waters of the bayou to plunder our righteous gains and cut our throats like a demon in the night. Could be. What have you the Walking Dead games are pretty big from what I remember. This Especially the VR one, I know. Mm -hmm. You, who have brought nothing but chaos. Maybe not Walking Dead. I mean, it's like... When death was kind of swallowing this called? city whole, it was I who Dead resurrected it. it. No, 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 no. Shined as a beacon of well, that's kind of uh, first person one. Yes, dying light. Yes, yes, dying light. And I, I don't think it is though. To spill it. When the bells ring, the song they sing will be righteous. I feel like it might be Dead Rising because of like the goofy weapons. Retribution. Just oh, walking oh. dead. Well, you were at the first time. Yep. Feel your gut. It just got a little like too weird for feel like Walking Dead to me. 
VRWalkingDead.com. Cool. I mean, it definitely gives me a lot more of a, the uh, Dead Rising vibes. I like more arcadey. I already would throw up. I thought No Man's Sky was already VR. Well, it's for the VR 2, the PlayStation. Fair enough. Is this No Man's Sky? I don't even know. Yeah, it is. Oh, yeah. all right. Yo, this game's changed so much since I... They just had the Leviathan update. Pretty cool. There's space whales now. Remember when that game released and there was literally nothing? Yep, and I held on to it. Best spur of the moment decision. Is that Horizon game? Yeah. Yep. I, I don't know, guys. Question. Could be something different, something new. Everyone says Reyes is a good shot. Yeah, and it'll put arrows through both of us. You're switching with me. I need to pick up the new Horizon game for a PlayStation. I just can't shoot with the controller, so I'm nervous. We're not gonna make it. Whoa. Whoa. Holding hands. That's my it's least favorite thing about VR. Why? Redemption Whoa. Is still possible. A lot of climbing. That's kind of cool. Find out why the machines are attacking. Might, might get a little old though. <laughs> uh, I would love to shoot. Like my favorite VR games are bow and arrow games for obvious reasons. So. Do that. Ooh, buddy. It, it looks beautiful. Wits, it does, yeah. Your skills. Yeah, that can't be understated. Like, VR game looks definitely good. There's no way it actually looks this good, like, in headset, right? <laughs> now no. it's time to climb into the light. I love how Horizon is just, like, growing. Yeah, it's such like a unique Hi, concept. I'm Ben McCaw, narrative director at Guerrilla. I hope you enjoyed your first look at Horizon Call of the Mountain, coming exclusively to PlayStation Thanks, VR ben. 2. We're also happy to announce that a big update to Horizon Forbidden West, including New Game Plus, will be available to download on PlayStation 4 and PlayStation 5 today. Pretty amazing. Is it the new game plus from the beginning? Oh. Ah. I really need to pick this game up. Oh, the first one was really good. <laughs> until Details the on this free update. Please check out PlayStation Blog. From all of us at Gorilla, thank you for your continued support. And please stay tuned for more updates to come. I played as much as I could, but the performance issues at the beginning, were, it was game. brutal. It's literally the reason I upgraded my computer. Yeah, I, I need to I need to play it again. I probably would never have stopped these past few years sacrificing so new much Spider -Man game. asking for nothing. If you want to change the world, yep. you have to be the kind of man. Spider Man, they, the they pump these games out. They look so good. I just do, can't do it. Ooh, Spider Man is doing, they're doing some trap workout. Mm. I'm gonna go. Uh... I'm probably the uh, only like okay for superheroes. I feel like most people like Spider Man the most. I don't care for Spider Man that much. I don't know why. This doesn't do it for me. The only superhero I care about is Batman. Oh! Did you just leave your oh, coming to PC. Uh... Hmm. Yeah, that's good for fans, you know, who want to get in. It's cool seeing Sony. Oh, is this the Stray Cat, Cat one? Yes! It's Coconut! Coco! Got a little bag on his back. Who's, 
He's scared. He's vibing. If, uh, if this is going to be realistic, he needs to sleep in a corner for 16 hours. <laughs> He's Say... doing way too much moving. There's way more movement than I've ever seen my cat do. Whoa. <laughs> yep, that is that's about right. That's the cat way. <laughs> Most realistic thing I've ever seen. It's a bit cute, cute little game. I would literally buy this game just because it's a cat game. <laughs> it's so ridiculous, but <laughs> it's kind of cool. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> If you don't have nine lives in this game, I will not pick it up. You just only get nine lives and you just start over, like Hellblade. Yeah. Meow. Stray. What's your creative name? Let me tell you, if that game has a sad <laughs> ending, I will find whatever studio made it. And riot. Will, we will riot in front of them. Coming to PS5 and PS4 July 19th. If anything happens to that cat, PlayStation Plus riot. extra members and higher can download Stray at no extra cost when it launches next oh. month. Ooh. Up next, well. three games that will get your heart racing. That's pretty cool. Free cat game. Bip. I know it looks like it's not. It kind of looks like Dead Space style. That's what my thought was too. That they call Callisto the Dead Moon. Callisto. Oh my gosh, dude! I totally forgot about this game. Like you would have been if I hadn't fished you out of this is like the game that looks just like Dead Space. So no they announced it like two, three years ago. That's your old life. You gotta let that go because you're. Life is Ooh. entirely <laughs> in my hands. I'm just trying to give you a chance at rebirth. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Holy crap, this looks amazing. Ah! Yeah, this looks really good. Give me like Dead Space and Last of Us vibes together. Yeah. We're getting probably on the horror, Brad. It's happening. It gives better. Chills every He's time. coming. Well, Dead Space is like the only one I like. <laughs> Callisto. That's definitely that's, a pickup. That's like a day one. Ooh, Christmas. Jeez. All right. Yeah, but it's on PlayStation, so. So I guess you're just going to have to buy one, Bravo. Been hustling around with it a little too much. Now it's going to happen. Rolls. A new blood sport grips the globe. And in the arena. There Roller will be Derby? Victorious. What is it? I don't know, but I absolutely hate the art style. Well, I think it's hard to go from that really extreme realism to this. <laughs> yeah. Well, well, it's not hard, but... I don't think I'd like this anyway, but... You know what it looks like? I don't know if you guys ever heard of it. It's called Cell Damage. It was like a racing car combat game. It was on, like, GameCube. PS2 and stuff. I've heard of it, I don't know much about it, but this game... It, it looks like exactly like this, like, art style. Yeah, it's not for me. I like the slow-mo thing, that's pretty cool. It's interesting, but... I don't know if I could get past the graphics. I, I'm... I think we're all in the same boat, like... There's been a couple games in the last six months or so that have this kind of, like... I don't know, hand-drawn... 
it wants to be associated with yeah. staying in the anime aesthetic. If things mm. will ever be normal again. I don't think yeah. he's gonna make it. He's got a problem with his hands. <laughs> Just one hand. Whoa! Oh. Oh. Oh, the weebs. They're gonna be excited about this one. I can tell. Rhythm game? The they turned into a girl. It's not hopeless. I won't let anyone else get hurt! If this is based on a sh show or something, I have no idea. Yeah, I mean, you do. I, don't I mean, it looks cool visually. Oh, you. But. I'm going to I... miss them. Oh, you get to hold R2 to hold hands. It's a dating sim. The kiss. Curious if it's anything we've heard of, though. Nice. Nope. Nope. <laughs> Absolutely not. Scratch that idea. Looks cool if that's your thing. Not my thing. Yeah. Sure, people are out there uh, excited about that one. Action games and dating sims collide in Eternite, coming to PS4 and PS4 <laughs> next year. <laughs> Robin, did you say that exact thing? <laughs> yeah. Upcoming heavy hitter. Heavy hitter. <sighs> I forgot my cookies in the kitchen. That looks like a Capcom character on the bottom left. It looks like a Street Fighter character. I think it's his Street Fighter. It is, yeah. There's Hugo, yeah. Yep. Capcom's oh, must... still a business? <laughs> I'm sorry. I wonder if it's when the new for Street Fighter. Mm. It's not mm -mm. like a game. This journey doesn't have a real ending. Okay then, hope you're ready to begin. If you want to start off on the right foot in this city, hit the streets. Yeah, hey there I do this, never fear losing. And when I get up in the game, you're up here improving. A real proud of what I saw from all face proof. And if you think you're going forward, then you told me fool. Yeah, y'all want to win, let me spin, boy. I've done some stuff. So like an open world? Wait a minute. I was just about to say, is this an open world Street Fighter game? Like you're you you create your own character and fight everybody. That's interesting. That's kind of cool. Yeah, it actually is. You're dead. Oh. Oh. Never played Street Fighter. You've never played any Street Fighter? Nope. Oh. There's a chance I played like the original, but I definitely don't remember. I was always a Tekken and Mortal Kombat kid. Let me have some fun. Ready? Most Soul never. Caliber. Was mine. Now I'm confused. So is it just regular no, Street Fighter battle? It looked like it looked like the guy ran through the streets, open world, and once and he came in he contact played. with somebody, it became Ah uh, yeah. And then it probably also has included the regular Street Fighter game too. Yeah. I mean that's cool for like uh you know, a single player content for a Street Fighter game. Mm-hmm. I'm behind that for sure. They are is pretty nice. I wonder if the splashy stuff is actually there at this part of the trailer. trailer. I hope it's there. The effects it, are pretty cool. It was in Street Fighter 4. Okay. That's how it was. Like, it was very, uh... It said Battle Hub. Oh, we got a hub world. This kind like of reminds it. me of, like... I feel like it's gonna be, like, the NBA Park or whatever it was, where there's, like, the online area you could run around as your character. Mm -hmm. That's the kind of vibe I get from what we've seen. I like it. I'm 
Interesting. That sure. was your first look at Street Fighter 6 gameplay. Mark your calendars. Yeah, it looks cool. It comes to PS5 uh, the only thing I know about Street Fighter is Chun Li, so. <laughs> Now it's time for two indie adventures arriving later Tuna. this year. This game's awesome. I didn't know this was an on PlayStation. Yeah. I haven't got very far in it, but this PlayStation game. said, "Oh, that's a popular game? Yeah, get over here." Cool. It's pretty much a Zelda clone, right? Kind of. It's a bit soulsy as well. Hmm. It reminds me of a game called Moonlighter that I really liked. It's on Game Pass already. Tunic. Hmm. Could check it out if I have time. It does look cool. It does look like a good game. I mean, I've seen it before, obviously. She set out to record life at the end of this season. So this guy is just to make it real for people in the future. I'd be so scared to fall going that she fast on the hill. About living together. And we asked her about traveling alone. When the season turns, what will remain? Only what she saw. Do they have a Walkman? What she captured. Their side. Notice. She carries the sounds of the season with her. If this is a picture taking game, what it feels like, and a, looks, looks like a probably video. you want to tell her everything. I got to look in her journal. Probably like reminiscent of that journey game where it's like about the experience. I think she even figured out what will happen to us when the season ends. Is it I know we were talking crap about the art style of that one game, but this game actually looks pretty good. Like this game style. is like a different style, though. Not yeah. Yet. Yeah. I think it's. I think it's because it has a lot more variation in colors. Like it. It's not just all. Mm -hmm. What small power? Somebody correct me. Pastels? It was pretty. Yeah, it was pretty good. Yes, 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 it was pretty Dude, there's like too many of these games for me to like ever possibly get into them. The perk is none of them are connected. <laughs> I know. But it's still like oh, it's right. I can't get into a game that's 16 games deep without starting at one. Even though I know they're separate. Mm -hmm. No, I feel you. If I like a game in the series, I'm like, I gotta collect them all. Gotta catch them all. What are the dominance? The power we wield, it wears away at all. Come on, the bird! It breaks Final us. Fantasy always it looks so us. cool. That its immaculate aspect might reveal itself. Summons are always pretty cool. The icon. Which is what I'm guessing those are. There's going to be another one. I have no idea what that even means. You can like summon these, uh, I don't even know what they're exactly called. They're like these giant creatures, like dragons and stuff. The chaos he would wreak would sweep all of Valisthea into the abyss. I will say, the, uh, not turn based combat makes it cooler for me. That we may bring an end to the strife. These beat em ups are just like too much for me. Order to see us unto tomorrow. If I take the field, our duel will shake the That's island big dude. to its foundations. Yeah. 
useful. I think that's Shiva. Yeah, Ifrit, Bahamut, Shiva. Those are all like the summons. Just like because she's ice. <laughs> that kicks to you. Or two. There will be losses, it is true. Yet for every citizen who falls, another can be bred. For every home that burns, another can be built. The Empire will live on. That is pretty good. Look good, honestly. It did. I just know that, like, I get sensory overloaded with those beat em up games with so many lights. That's a wrap. Don't forget to visit PlayStation what? Blog to learn even more oh. about today's announcement. Nice, sweet, See to the point, time. huh? No. Where's the rest of it? What? No. <laughs> <laughs> That's I'm so all, excited folks. about so many things. Not really. The, uh, obviously, Resident Evil 4 is insane. And yep. then the Callisto game. Those yeah, two were like, oh, what I yeah. really took out of it for sure. Though I mean, those are huge, but um, honestly, it was a lot bigger than I expected it to be. So yeah, the Callisto game looks pretty cool. Um, I'm in. I'm in. On yeah. that game. I'm excited That's for Resident Evil for you guys. Um, You're buying it. I'm not, You're not gonna, getting an option. I'm not gonna yeah, buy yeah. the game. You're buying it. I can't even <laughs> play it. <laughs> it's most people's first Resident Evil game. Resident there is Ford. no way that that game's exclusive on PlayStation. No, not a chance. Not a, there's not a prayer. So, you think I'm so? surprised that they even let PlayStation be the one to announce it. Hmm. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I don't know. I'm a little surprised as well. It had to be just because of the VR part of it. That's the only thing that's going to be unique to playstation yeah it, it probably makes them have like a small partnership because they did so well with resident evil 7 yep vr and whatnot so they're like oh well we're partnering once again so here yeah. it is but mm -hmm. it's without a doubt coming to everything not even yeah. a question yep so well you can get in whatever whatever you'd like thanks for watching this episode uh greatly appreciate you i'm just kidding do we want to keep going uh, I don't know. I mean, we can uh, hop into, we can end this one and then do our short on the Diablo one. Oh. Deal. Yeah. You follow, <laughs> subscribe, hit the heart button, yell at us on Twitter, envision underscore org. Catch you next time.